Okay. Oh. Hello. How we sound? Does it sound okay? It's good. It does no crunch. Oh, thank God for that. Hang on. Oh, so we just moved the entire PC over behind where the camera is. I think it sounds okay. Let me just test. Is the audio good? Just got an ad for pizza. That's a good sign. Audio is good. Oh, thank God for that. Okay, hang on one second. Let me just do one or two more things. Do you guys even hear the music? I know you can't. You can't hear that anymore. Let me just uh, fix that. If the only option for audio is disabled, that's not good. Uh, hang on. Let me try one thing real quick. If I plug in some dummy headphones... Then it might... There we go! How's that? Music? Audio good? Hang on, hang on. I have to look over here to talk to you so I can know until I get you set up on my phone. Good audio, oh thank god. Alright, and the music's not too loud, is it? I'll turn it down just a little bit just to be safe. Okay. Jesus. Hi! Give me one second. Feels like the entire universe is against us any time we try to have fast food on this channel. Be it pizza or McDonald's or trying to cook pizza in the safety of our own kitchen. We have something that goes wrong. Let me just make sure everything is working correctly and I'm gonna get you up on my phone here so I can talk to you. I need the chat specifically. We got get McDonald's instead. No, we're making a healthy dinner. We don't need takeout. We can save some money. Give us some good old flour. Tomato passata. And a dash of love. Uh, that looks quite menacing if I say it. And a dash of fucking love. <laughs> looks like I'm about to attack someone. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I'm gonna give people just two minutes just to get onto the stream, um, just, ju just because of the, the, the technical issues. Thank you so much everyone for bearing with me too. Uh, so the problem there was, we had a USB extension cord specifically for the Elgato cam link. Elgato really does not like that, and I think that's what was making the audio crunchy. Um, but we should be okay now, we're operating off our camera. We got bat- I got extra batteries for the camera, so if it does die completely, um, just scream into the void. I would appreciate that. Um, so that way we can change the battery. Um, I think we should be good. I love the apron. Ah, oh, thank you very much. I can't remember. Oh, this is bad. I can't remember if it was my mother who got me this for Christmas or if it was Josie. It was Josie. I left the text on the screen. Hang on. I have assistance. It was Josie. I'm so sorry because she's there in the chat too. I'm so sorry. They're screaming into the void. No, I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. There's no need to scream. There's no need to scream. I'm still here. You can see me, yeah? I'm here. I'm here. He's gone again. <laughs> My chat's gonna have, like, abandonment issues at this rate. 
Like anytime like he just leaves the screen for a little bit, it's like uh, <laughs> I can I can actually see the screams in real time. Like watch this. Oh thank god he's back again. <laughs> Terror. The lighting's a bit weird. The lighting might be a bit weird. Let me see if I can adjust it. Hang on. Is that any better? Is that any more well lit? The lighting is a bit weird. We have a lot of yellow lights here. And it's all bouncing off these solid white. Does it look okay? Why did you leave us? Father mocks us. Where is he? Is the lighting okay? The lighting okay? I might look like a bit yellow or something like that just because of like the amount of it bouncing off here. It should be alright. Lighting's good. We've had so many tech problems. Like, it's always, it's always, anything to do with pizza on this channel tends to just go horrifically wrong. I'm, I'm not entirely sure why. Um, but we're here. Welcome. It's good to see us. I hope you're ready for a nice healthy meal. We're gonna make pizza live on stream as promised for chat. Because I know we've had this whole McDonald's saga where McDonald's just simply has failed us like on a couple of separate occasions. Uh, but it's happening. It's happening. We're getting homemade fast food. It's not very fast, but there's more love put into it. Hope that's worth some. But I want a McDonald's. This is way better than McDonald's. You don't even need Domino's with this. This is way better. You get to put the toppings you want on the pizza from the limited selection I've got available in the fridge. Um, we don't have a lot of them. That's way better. That's way better. It's buffering? Is it okay? Yeah, I'm, I'm like, I'm very anxious about the the stream quality. It's all good? It's all good? Good here. Okay, sorry. Anxious, yeah, see here's what I'm looking into as we go. I've got all of you here in the palm of my hand. Okay, and I have a recipe uh, that I need to follow. Let me just do my tab management. So courtesy of the BBC, we got pizza margarita in four easy steps, okay? We're gonna make a margarita pizza. This is the recipe we're following along. You can follow along with it too. And we're just gonna make margarita and then we throw on all the good stuff we want. Hang on, what? Is chat okay? It's in four steps. It's in four steps. Yep. Dad's secret pizza. Uh, typically, if it's dad's recipe, it tends to be a bit lazier. Um, I don't know where I was going with that thought. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna get started. I need to get a bowl. Hang on. I think I have a bowl. Sorry. You're probably gonna hear every single sound. This mic is like super sensitive. Um, you can probably hear Kelly in the background just as she's been kind of been helping me uh, kind of set up some tech bits. <laughs> Yeah, she says hi, like, you can probably hear her as we go. Uh, cause we, we have to like, ferry the entire PC over, like, in, like, a ten minute interval. Everyone's saying hi. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was quiet. Uh, no, the, the, the mic's just super sensitive, yeah. they can probably hear you, like, she's actually quite far away. Um, okay, I need a bowl. I, I've never done this before as well, you know, that's how you know it's gonna be special. We're on an adventure together. For today's stream. Okay, so make the base. I have to pour my flour in a large bowl, stir in the yeast and salt. So I need 300 grams of strong bread flour. Okay. Uh, of course. So we don't. We, now this is important to establish. So I'm Irish Canadian, uh, which means that anything that's given in metrics uh, when it comes to cooking. Uh, I actually have to convert to the cup measuring system, okay? Now, my solid one cup is gone at the moment, but the easy conversion is this is a three-quarter cup, 
which is 180 milliliters, which is 180 grams. Um, so if I fill this once and in two thirds of the way, easy metric to put in the bowl. Uh, we don't, I don't have a scale or anything of the sort. Um, so we have to do everything in cups while we go. Okay, so it's real easy though. It's real easy once you get a handle on it, okay? Uh, if you're ever stuck, just remember that one eight cup is 30 milliliters, which is 30 grams, okay? And then you can convert it. So we basically need 10 of these, or one and two thirds of these, okay? Now we can also, if you want to be fun about it, you can use five of these ones. Um, or you can use three and a mostly full one of these, okay? I wish I had a standard cup, it'd be easier to explain, but we should, we should be our- Is everyone following? Is everyone following? You better be. We're all gonna finish our pizza at the same time, right? Sir? The yarn I need to wash. The yarn? Oh, okay. I, I, I washed my hands before we started. But I can, okay, I can do it again. Okay, hang on. So we have... Okay, the dishwasher, uh, the dishwasher there is just open. Uh, that's just because it, we just ran it. But look, okay, look. Evidence. See? You take your time, do the back as well. Very important. Very important you wash your hands. Wait, what? My sleeves. <laughs> oh, sorry. Okay, hang on. Let me roll up my sleeves. Hang on. Okay. You guys take this very seriously. <laughs> It's like, for the love of God, he's gonna contaminate the food. Hang on, okay. There we go. The sleeves have been rolled. To the best of my abilities, they kind of just gotta hang in there. Okay, what else? What else? A hairnet. I... <laughs> I don't have a hairnet, guys. But it's not that long. Like... We're gonna be fine. Like, like, that's just worrying over nothing, right? Like, Gordon Ramsay, whenever he's doing one of his cooking programs, have you ever seen him with a hairnet? Like, no. Well, Gordon Ramsay's got, like, gel and shit. Like, he's probably, like, leaking product into the food. Yo, it's, like, everywhere. He'll yell at you for your lamb being raw, but it's, like, your lamb's probably been fucking stylized by the time he's done with it with the amount of product that's, like, seeped into it. That's how his food is so good. <laughs> it's just made with chemicals and shit. Okay. Gordon Ramsay, please don't sue. He's a very angry man. Okay. Alright, uh, so before, with the cable setup and the extension, I was gonna tout the feature of that. I can sh I can bring the camera over here. Um, unfortunately, with the way that this is now... <clears throat> ...worked out... Hang on, it's a bit bumpy. Uh, I can now only bring the camera over here and I'm gonna have to crouch down so you can see the counter. What I can do is if I put it together in the bowl, I can like mix it like this. And that, 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 that should work. Are you okay? I'm gonna be sick. Put us in the oven. <laughs> okay, people are, people are being weird. People are being weird. So we can move, hang on, you come with me, we can move the camera a little bit, right? Like if I crouch a bit you can get the top of my head in. I'm gonna look quite tall just because of the angle of this, that's fine. Looks like my hands are massive if I do that. <laughs> Jesus, they're bigger than his head. Okay, alright, it's pizza time. So, 300 grams. I have a strong red flour. Jesus, that's dusty. I'm gonna show you how to make pizza, okay? Okay, so we're just gonna treat that as a bit extra of a cup. You didn't see it. 
You didn't see it, right? Uh, let me put this down. Uh-huh. You know, it's better to have too much flour than not enough, really. It's better to have too much flour than not enough. You don't want to run out of flour halfway, you know? So let's pop all that in. Let me just dust my hands off with the, from the flour. Dust my hands off. Okay. I need a teaspoon of instant yeast from a sachet or a tub. And I need a teaspoon of salt. Um, so I'll be honest, um, when it comes to salt and stuff, um, I always have my salt in a shaker and I never have time to measure that out. So it's just, that's probably about a teaspoon. Um, and then we need a sachet. Uh, we got one of these. Now it's one... No, oh, it's a tablespoon. Sorry. It's a tablespoon of salt. Here we go. Put some more of that in. It's an exact size. Uh, and then we need a thing of yeast. Probably about a tablespoon in there. Probably about a tablespoon in there. Let me get my scissors. I'm prepared. For all situations. Get our yeast. And then... That just goes in there. Here's how we're looking so far. It's going well. Okay. Then I have to stir this all in. I mean, there's not much to stir, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. It's like... It, it, it's just powders. Can you see that okay? I have to like, be careful with the bowl so it doesn't fall out. <laughs> Can you see that okay? There you go. Look at that. Okay, I mean, that that's, that's pretty much mixed. There's not much you can do there. It's just yeast and salt at the moment. Uh... Make a well, pour in 200 milliliters of warm water and the olive oil. And bring together with a wooden spoon until you have soft, fairly wet dough. Okay, so I need... How much water do I need? No, I just said... 200 milliliters of water. Warm water. Get the hot tap going. We're gonna, we're gonna use filtered water, because only the best for our pizza, right? Get a load of that. See that fancy thing on the sink? Look at that. That's how you know it's going to be good quality. We treat you in this house. Uh, and then I need some olive oil. Now look, it's extra virgin. Some of you might be acquainted with this, right? That's the good stuff. Okay. Let's get this water in. Okay, so we need about 200 milliliters. Now, our, our measuring cup holds 180, so we just need to fill that up and then a little bit more, okay? There's our water. It's nice and warm. We got a few bubbles on it, but that should be okay. Put that in. And then just a little bit more. I didn't make a well, but it should be okay. That should be all right. Um, uh, and then I need a tablespoon of olive oil Plus extra for drizzling. Let me let me stop the tap. Let me stop the tap. Unbelievable. We don't have a single spoon in the house. Oh no. Every tablespoon is gone. Um, but that's okay because we have a teaspoon. And the rule that you have to remember is it's two and a half teaspoons to the tablespoon. So it's okay, you can convert all of these metrics as we go, and we should hopefully be okay, right? Just keep track of it all, you can write it down. If you're cooking along at home, and you've also forgotten the utensils... I have extra tablespoons, it's okay. Just follow along, just follow along, okay? I'll pick that one up off the floor later. Okay, so 
So get our olive oil in. There we go. Okay. Uh, now what? I'll get on that later. I'm sure it'll be fine. I, I, I haven't read the bit where it says preheat the oven. I can turn it on for funsies. We'll get- I don't know what temperature the oven needs to be, uh, because I haven't seen the instructions yet, but I put it on 180 and we can just kind of guesstimate it from there. You know? <laughs> it's usually pretty hot. Yeah, we, we, we should be okay. We should be okay. Hang on, now let me- let me- because you're gonna miss out on the action here. Hang on. Let me show you what's going on here, right? Okay. Look at all that. Look at all that. So I'm gonna just mix away here until we get a bit of soft dough, okay? I'm gonna give you some dough action. Come with me. You're coming with me. God, that's a terrible angle. <laughs> okay, hang on, wait, the camera just got shorter. Hang on. Okay, maybe, maybe, maybe you shouldn't come on an adventure with me. Maybe you shouldn't come on an adventure with me. Let me just, uh... How have I done this? Why is the camera permanently tilted? Hang on. Okay, that works. That works. I can hunch over. I don't mind doing that. See? So now you guys can see where I'm at. And we're making our dough. Look at that! Look at that! Make our dough. How long have I got to mix this for? Bring together a wooden spoon until you have a soft, fairly wet dough. Turn onto a lightly floured surface and knead for five minutes until smooth. Kelly, what does kneading mean? You massage it. Okay, that's a bit oh. weird. Right, uh... I'm not used to that term. I haven't, I haven't done this before. Yeah. My sleeve keeps fucking falling down. Alright. Let me just knead this a bit. No, this isn't quite kneading. Sorry, this is just mixing it. It's kind of hard to tell how much, like... It says it should just be, like, soft, fairly wet, though. What do we think? That, that looks kind of soft and wet. What do we think? Let me see, I have to reach out. It's too wet. It's too runny? Uh, what do I put? I don't know how to fix that. Do I put more flour in? Okay, more flour, right. Hopefully this will just balance it out somehow. <laughs> I don't know what's happening at this point. It's alright. Let me get chat on my phone. See how you're all doing. Hello, hello. We're so doomed. It's Jesus Christ. It's pizza, guys. Father cat cook. I'm cooking. It's supposed to be a wet dough! Right? Father, I lacked object permeance. <laughs> Some of you are gonna be real anxious about the moon. You haven't seen it in a while. The camera turned again. It's doing that by itself. There we go. It's just gonna do that while we go, right? It should be fine. I think that this is much more dough-like. See, like, that's, like, stuck to my finger now. See? Ugh. Oh. <laughs> Give me one second. <laughs> God, I hope they can't see that. Ugh. Ugh. So, sample it! 
uh, when you prepared it a bit more, it's, it's it, really you gotta trust the recipe for now. Uh, it's like olive oil went up my nostrils. But it should be okay. It should be okay. Should be okay. Alright, we got our dough. This is just the first pizza as well. We're gonna have to do all of this again, like at least two or three times, um, until we get, you know, enough to feed the, um, I don't know how many of you are here. It's several thousand. We're gonna need a lot of pizzas. But this, this is pizza number one. This is the first of many. I'm treating you all. We don't need fast food. We're gonna save some money. I just ripped my shirt. Oh, I'm good. Okay. Okay. So, let me clear a bit of space, put my scissors away, move that, move the sachet, probably shouldn't have my phone on the surface because I need to put um, the dough on it. Okay, I'm going to see if I can get you in here. <laughs> see if... Okay, the camera's turning a little. <laughs> the camera's fighting. <laughs> Hang on. If I... Just give me one second. This is all part of the process. This is how you make pizza. That's fine. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Okay, now you get in nice and close to see the pizza action. The camera keeps fucking turning. The camera keeps turning. <laughs> I don't know why, like, I want it there. <laughs> why does it keep? <laughs> I can fix it, hang on. Perfect, now you can see. Okay, we'll just move our workout. That should be fine. That should be fine. Okay. So... <laughs> Welcome to a headless man bakes you a delicious meal. Like, much like your, like, like, you know, point of view, your dad makes you pizza, but you haven't seen dad in a while. So, you know, this perspective is actually ideal. He's actually, like, like doing this from afar. He's making himself pizza. Would it be easier if I hold your hand? No, it's good. Okay. Okay. So, where's the recipe gone? Hang on. I need to turn onto a lightly floured surface. I think that's about right. I think that's about right. That should work. And then I need to knead it for five minutes until smooth. Cover with a tea towel and set aside. You can leave the dough to rise if you like, but it's not essential for a thin crust. So I need to knead the dough. What's chat saying? This hurts. That's lightly floured. That's lightly floured. He left us. Oh, sorry, sorry. Avi Permians. I forget it's an issue on this channel. Hang on, I'm, I'm back. I'm back. I'm not gone. I'm not gone. The camera's fucking turning again. <laughs> there we go. It's okay. I'm here. I'm here. I'm also trapped in a box for some reason. That's just a perspective we've chosen on this cooking channel. Okay. Alright, I need to lightly knead the dough. 
Let's get this on out. Okay, here it comes. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Now that's some doughy dough. That's some doughy dough. Let's get... Get a good shot of that. Get a good shot. Okay, how do I need it? <laughs> this is a mistake. I, I, surely I just use, like, a roller. Like, th we're not gonna make any progress like this. Surely I just roll it. Punch it. Put flour on your hands. Hang on. Like this? Oh, look at that! That's actually kind of fun! Oh, it's everywhere. Oh my god, it's everywhere. You can play the drums! It's actually not going too badly now. Apart from the bit that's caked permanently into my skin. Okay, and look, we're gonna get a nice round circle shape, okay? Round circle. We're gonna make it just like they do at the pizzeria. Like, your friends, if I make that pizza for them, you know, you have them around after school, they're gonna be like, holy shit. I didn't know your dad was a... professional... <laughs> chef. And you can be just like, that's right. Restaurant quality. We don't settle for anything lesser. I think, I think, I think that's lightly needed. Wait, how long does it say to do? Five minutes until it's smooth. Oh my god, okay. Sure, can I just use like a roller? Can I? Is anyone gonna fault me? Hang on. Let me just wash my hands again. Oh, it's all bread. I've got bread everywhere. I'm still here. I'm still here. Don't panic. Hang on. Okay, I'm still here. I'm still here. I've got a nice roller here, right? We can cause some damage with this. Look at this. Look at this. We can get it nice and smooth. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Okay. It's looking good. It's a bit wrinkly. It's a bit wrinkly, but it should be okay. I think it should be okay. How we doing? You're not supposed to roll it. Fold it? Oh wait, is that what needing is? Oh, sorry, I can- oh, okay. Oh, okay, let me get all this back. Sorry, I didn't realize, okay. <laughs> I'm gonna need more flour, hang on, let me just gather some from the board. Is this needing it? <laughs> is that what I was supposed to do? I can't see what the chat says. But it's moving really quickly, so I assume that's a good thing. Okay, hang on. Press it on the board and fold it. 
What do you mean fold it? Like, like push it into the, the board and like... <laughs> like that? <laughs> do I slap it again? What's chat saying? What do you mean, fold it? You need to watch the tutorial. What do you mean? I don't need to watch the tutorial. This is a professional restaurant. <laughs> like this? It's really just starting to come off my hands. I'm trying! Okay, I think if I roll it out from here, it should be okay. It should be okay. Let me just wash my hands again. My fucking sleeve keeps coming down. Hang on. Okay. Give me another towel. Give me another towel. There we go. Let me check that. Please, no. I'm gonna close your knees like a cat. Okay, oh, it's a knee like a cat. So, like, this? I don't know how to... <laughs> I don't know how to need it! Listen, right? Hang on, let me check this. I'm just trying to get it smooth, am I? So like a ball. It's pretty smooth. It's pretty smooth. Okay, we can work with this. We can work with this. I think this is good. Let me show you. I think that's pretty good. I think that's pretty good. Ow, finger. Treat it like it's a cat, and I don't know what that means. You know, a cat comes up and starts kneading your leg. Yeah, so like that. That's what I'm supposed to do. I don't see what that's accomplishing. <laughs> Has this man ever seen a cat? <laughs> I. <laughs> I think that's fine, and then we roll out, it'll be fine. Everything's mixed there, okay? We have enough, though. Yeah, we have enough, though. I'm gonna wash my hands. We're gonna make the sauce next. We're gonna make the sauce. Let me just get the towel over here. Oh, my hands are clear, don't worry, don't worry. Okay, hang on. I'm gonna make the sauce next. Let me. Maybe this is when all, everything started to go wrong. The moment we got more close and personal with the camera perspective. So maybe if I just move it back. It does look like everything is tilted for some reason, but I can lean slightly to the left to kind of balance it out. I should be okay. It should be alright. There is flour everywhere. <laughs> okay, right, so I, I if, if I lean left, then it should be okay. It should be alright. Okay. Alright. Sauce time. Mix the basada, basil, and crushed garlic together, then season to taste. Leave to stand at room temperature while you get on with shape in the base. Okay. So I'm gonna need another bowl. We're a bit short on bowls. Yeah. Got a bowl. Okay, so how much of this do I need? 
The main thing is the Posada, which is just a hundred milliliters. That's just twenty percent of this carton. One of your five a day. Let me get chat back up on my end. Need the damn dough. Wait, I need to cover the dough. Let me get another towel. Hang on. Let me just. I'm just. I'm just getting a towel. Hang on. I'm just. Don't mind the alcohol. I'm just looking for a towel. Okay, hang on. Let me put this all away. Let me just put this all away. You know, we might need the Jack Daniels later, honestly, depending on how this goes. Depending how this goes. Okay, uh... Oh, I just wiped my hands with I need another towel. Hang on. Let me just... Don't mind the alcohol again. Hang on. Don't mind the alcohol. Really debating keeping this one out. Really debating keeping that one out. But no, we should be good. We should be good. Okay. Alright, so I just need to cover this dough, apparently. That's all I do. Do I, do I, does it have to be in a bowl? I got this bowl, okay, hang on. Wait, cover, do you mean cover with the bowl or put it in the bowl? <laughs> I mean, that's functionally the same as it being in the bowl. It needs more room to rise. Oh, okay, hang on. Let's get some of those stringy bits. Okay, and now we cover it. Now we cover it. I'm just trying to get this bit of dough off my finger. The bowl is too small? A fucking Goldilocks over here, I didn't realize. Like, what? Wait, what, what kind of bowl do you want? I have a bigger bowl, hang on. <coughs> Will this do? There we go. Is that good enough for you? Is that good enough for you? There you go. And we cover that. There we go. Perfect. It's going well. It's going well. Oil the bowl? It didn't actually say that in the recipe. What do you mean, oil the bowl? <laughs> you need to oil- What do you mean, oil the bowl? <laughs> like, put some fucking, like, olive oil in it. What's that gonna do? Stops it from sticking. Do I just pour oil on it? <laughs> if I put this in, this is really gonna mess up the constituency. Wait, please. 
Oh, okay, hang on, wait, so I was supposed to... Okay, hang on, so I was supposed to do this first. This one was in the sink, but it's still good. Uh, okay, so if I get this, if I put it back in that bowl, and then we oil this one up... Okay, hang on. That's a nice dough texture there. Okay. I don't know what this accomplishes. <laughs> what, what's the point of this? This wasn't in the instructions! This wasn't in the instructions! You're all laughing at me, but I was trying to follow it! Hang on. I think that's right! I'll pour out the extra oil. There you go. Okay. And then I just put this back in? <laughs> this, this feels like a mistake. Well, in it goes. <laughs> okay, uh, let me let me just cover it with the towel again. <laughs> we'll lay that to rest. I'll cover it with a wet towel. Wait, what the fuck are you talking about? This isn't in the instructions! You gotta trust Dad's recipe here, right? Because he knows what he's doing and the BBC wouldn't lie. They're a reputable company, okay? <laughs> we need plastic. I, I don't... Why do we need plastic? That's not gonna accomplish anything. It's fine. I'm following the instructions, chat. We're making pizza dad's way. You can make your own pizza your way. Okay? We need to move this up. There we go. Okay, so make the sauce. That was the bowl I was gonna use for the sauce! It's okay, I have an identical bowl. I have an identical bowl. Alright. Okay, so I need a hundred milliliters of Posada. Now, if we go back to the cup measuring system. Uh, I got a 60 and a 30, so I fill the two of these. No, if I fill the 60 and then fill the 60 uh, two thirds of the way, that should give us enough. That should give us enough. Okay. How do I open this? Just. Moving on to the sauce, okay? There we go. Okay, this is open. Sixty. Put a bit extra in just to make sure that we have enough sauce. We don't want to have too little sauce. Too much sauce isn't much of a problem. There we go. Okay. Uh, I need basil and crushed garlic. Um, I think, okay, so th uh, this is the fun bit with the sauce, right? Behold my magical spice cupboard. So, we can put basil in the sauce, right? And we're gonna put some basil. But look at all the options we have. We have so many options here. There's so much here, and we can we can add extras to the sauce here. Let me see what how excited Chad is. Okay. So, because we're gonna get look. There's our basil. 
Do you want ground cumin? Cayenne pepper? Coriander? Paprika? Ginger? We have so many options. What do people want? What's standing out? I, I need to put in the garlic. Hang on. I, I have, um... It said crushed garlic, but I have garlic granules. I'm sure that's gonna be fine. I mean, it's the same difference, you know, this is just garlic, but in a more concentrated form. So we're just gonna, like, add some of that. Gonna add some of that. Put them all in. Guys, if you put them all in, that's gonna be like an explosion in your marriage. Like, you don't, you don't want that. That's gonna be really out of hand. We can't put every one of them. You can pick three. I'll give you three, okay? Pick three. Okay, someone said salt. <laughs> you have the entire selection of my magical spice cupboard and you go for fucking salt, not even availing of any of the other options. But all right. There's one. What else have we got? Wait, no, 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 the, the honey's not an option, guys. The honey's just in the cupboard. You're not, we're not putting fucking honey in it. Are you kidding me? That's going to destroy the constituency. That's not an option. <laughs> that, that's not supposed to be in the spice cupboard. Okay, someone said salt again, right? So that's two. Okay, you've chosen salt twice now, chat. You've chosen salt twice. We get one more. Cinnamon? That, that just sounds disgusting. Why would you put cinnamon in there? I need to see. No, we're good, we're good. Oregano, okay. Oregano, we love a good bit of oregano. Hang on, let me find it. Let me find it, hang on. Wait, hang on. Okay, the oregano expired in February. We can't do that one, we can't do that one. All right, what else from my magical spice cupboard would you like? What else would you like? We can't do the oregano, that one's gone. How we feeling? <laughs> Pepper. Yeah, okay, all right, so. You had all these options. Every spice from across Tesco. And you chose fucking salt and pepper and salt again. Right, well you don't... You don't get my magical spice covered. Keep that locked up. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. You, did, you don't deserve it. You don't deserve it. Okay. Yeah, so it's supposed to be a garlic clove, but we just put in garlic granules. I mean, same thing. It's garlic, ain't it? Wait. It doesn't go off for another two weeks. We're okay. Alright. Okay, and um, you need to mix it and then season the taste. Leave to stand at room temperature while you get on with shaping the base. Okay, so I just get a spoon, uh, a teaspoon, a teaspoon. We don't have, we don't have a big spoon. You know when you can just sniff salt? Sorry, it's just a sail in my nostrils. A fun fact, like while, while I'm making this, uh, my dad actually can't eat this because he's allergic to pepper now. I'm thankfully not. But um... 
Yeah, if this was my dad, he wouldn't be able to actually eat this, which is unfortunate. Just a bit of trivia. It's so... Uh, is it supposed to be so goopy? I mean, it's sauce. It's sauce. Okay. Okay, the sauce is prepared. How's the dough doing? Yeah, that's still covered with a tea towel. Okay. Not much happening there. Okay, so I have to roll out the dough and then split evenly into two balls. Oh, this is supposed to make two pizzas, I think, right? Really? Are we making two pizzas? Oh, this makes two small pizzas. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, this is perfect. Okay. No worries. Okay. So I need to roll out the dough. If you let it rise, give it a quick knead and split into two balls. On a floured surface, roll out the dough into large rounds about 25 centimeters across using a rolling pin. Okay, this is a bad time to mention that most of my trays um, are perfectly square. Um, but you know, the shape, the shape doesn't matter. The shape doesn't ma matter. Uh, ironically, uh, I have a specific tray which is called a pizza tray uh, that only works for frozen pizza because of all the holes in it. So if I put that in, it's just gonna fall through. Um, so like, th this might as well just be a frisbee. So as we're concerned today. Um, but it's okay, cause like Pizza Hut does square pizza, and that's a, that's you know like the premium pizza place, okay? That's like the fancy stuff. Might as well be Italian at that point. So we got we got two trays that we can use. We got two trays. Just uh, I'll stick them in there. Safety. Let me roll up my sleeves. Roll up my sleeves. Okay. So I need to roll out the dough. I just. It's like a bit of a cut. Oh, I lost. I, for, I forgot to take the spoon out. I don't know if you can see that. Okay, that. That should be okay. That should be okay. Um. There's just a bit of it that's like hardened. Flour on there. Get some more flour on there. There we go. That should be all right. How's chat doing? Cook it, please. The sauce needs to boil. No, you put the sauce on and then it all cooks. You don't boil the sauce. You're gonna just thin out the sauce if you do that. That's not what the recipe says! It just said mix it! Yeah, it doesn't matter! Chad is lying! <laughs> this is... <laughs> Someone just said this is so unbelievably stressful. I'm just making pizza! It's fun! We're having a fun afternoon with your dad! I got all these ingredients, I got my ma It took a while to stock up the magical spice cupboard, right? That took a while to get. There's a lot of Tesco orders. You know, that, that's like, that's like, uh, like, two years worth of spice. Which probably explains why a lot of it's gone off. But the stuff that hasn't is pretty good. The stuff that hasn't is pretty good. Okay. I need to roll out the dough. It's finally time. Oh, look at that. Look at that. I'll be honest, I still don't know what the extra oil did in there. I don't know what the extra oil accomplished. But it's good to go. It's good to go. You got away more? Punch it? Hey, what are you talking about? It's fine! What's wrong with my dough?
It takes one to three hours? Wait, what? <laughs> but the instructions said the prep was 25 minutes. What do you mean? I'm being gaslit. This is dad's recipe. This is dad's recipe. I'm not standing for this. No, I want to involve you in the process, but I don't want you to have to just like sit you down at the kitchen table and you watch me make this. Okay, and I mean it. We're having fun. And it's the correct way to have fun. And a responsible way. Okay? Come on. I'm following my recipe. It's my secret recipe. Published on the BBC, but you know what I mean. Okay, roll out the dough. And split into two balls. It looks a bit yellow. I think it's the olive oil. It, oh, that smells strong. The extra version. Oh, Jesus. Okay. So I need to cut it in two for a thin crust. And then split into two balls. And then we have to roll it out on floured surface. Uh, okay, so these, okay, so I, I need to clean some space. All the olive oil just went everywhere. Where's the cap for the olive oil? Where's the... Oh, shit. Okay, hang on. Let me move the... I don't want, I don't have any space to put this. Hang on, I need to... Put this back in the spice cupboard. Yeah. Okay, perfect. We have we have extra space. We found extra space. We found extra space. All right. So two bacon trays. Let me just clean up the olive oil. Oh, that can is gonna be yellow. That's fine. Okay, that's fine. Roll up my sleeves. Keep fucking falling down. <laughs> okay, roll out the dough. We finally get to use this bad boy, all right? We just dust it off a little bit. It's got covered earlier. I need to split it in two. So I'll use this large knife, okay? There we go. Let's separate it. Separate it. Should be all right for that knife now. Okay, and then I need split in the two balls. On a floured surface, roll out the dough into large rounds by 25 centimeters across using a rolling pin. Okay, so I, I need to do each of these, and I also need to flour these. Hang on, so. Go. And just flour. Flour. A little bit of extra flour. And then we tip off the excess flour. And there we go, they're ready. Um... 
Oh shit, no, I was supposed to cover that in bacon paper and then I was supposed to flour this. Okay, that's that it's fine. Uh, that that shouldn't affect it in any way. Just move this. Okay. So I need to I need to flatten this out. Look at this, I, I got a fancy rolling pin, see? This one's real cool because it has like measurements on it. You can like get specific sizes if you roll it. And we can use this to make sure that we get one that's like 25 centimeters. Exactly. We can measure it out. Wait a minute. That can't be. Is that all that 25 centimeters is? That's a small fucking pizza. It's supposed to be a bit bigger than that. That's really small. That can't be right. No, it's like 30 centimeters, is that? So. Okay. I. Yeah, the measurements are wrong. Okay, that's fine. No, no, it's from the middle. It's from the middle. I see what's going on. Okay, so 25. Oh, okay. All right. Okay, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. We can measure it out exactly. Okay. Roll our dough. Let's roll. Getting stuck a bit. Let's roll our dough. It, it's stuck to the cutting board. Spatula our dough real quick. Uh, throw on some more flour. Throw on some more flour. We need we need a little more. There we go. Okay, this actually looks pretty good. Holy shit, it actually looks pretty good. Hang on. So why not that bang? Hang on. Oh, look at that. Okay. All right, so the shape is a bit wrong. The shape is, you wanna come in close? Hang on. You wanna... See that there? Okay, so the shape, is not exactly perfect. But I think that should do. I think that's pretty good. I think that's pretty good. Hang on, let me uh, get you back in my kitchen. There we go. Okay. The shape, like, the shape doesn't matter. It's the taste that counts. It's the taste that counts, okay? So, what I need to do, I need to put down bacon paper. Hang on, let me, uh... Hang on, I got some of this. There we go. We got our paper, and I need to put the paper on these things here. That's fine. So there was, there was no point to really flour that. It, it should be all right. Um, that's a bit too much paper. Let me just... Give me two minutes. Hey, I'm just gonna fashion this. more off the top.
Okay, that's, that's, that's roughly correct. That should do. Okay, next I need to put this pizza on that paper. How we doing, chat? The flower is bad. I can clean off the flower. No, that's a valid concern. Hang on, I can. Okay, I'll get some more paper. Hang on. Yeah, no, it's fine. Don't worry. We'll 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 clean these off. Hang on. Safety first. There we go. down a bit. How much time have I spent cleaning compared to actually making the pizza at this point? I'm, I'm kind of curious. <laughs> Thank God this recipe makes two, because I thought we were going to have to do all this again. Let's try this down. Try this down. How's chat doing? How come the cooking lots played and involved? RT behind you! <laughs> oh no! I think behind me is chat, right? Let me get my phone. Hang on. So I can see ya. How you doing? You're all hungry, but don't worry. You know, cause McDonald's probably would have been here by now, right? But McDonald's like doesn't fill you at all, if you think about it. So like the hunger now is just gonna make you savor the quality of the cuisine that we're preparing here for you later. You know, so like think about it. It's gonna be worth the wait. It's gonna be worth the wait. We're going as fast as we can. It's like fast food with modest preparation. Now it's important. Okay. The bacon trays are clean. There's no more flour on them. We're gonna be good. Let me get some more. There's flour. No, sorry, there's the paper. Oh. There's more of the paper. Okay. The trays are lined. Trays are lined, that should be okay. People are freaking out about the paper. It's going to be inedible, what do you mean? That please just use Google. I'm following the recipe! It's fine! The recipe says, you can leave the dough to rise if you like, but it's not essential for a thin crust. You don't have to. The dough is made. The dough is made. The paper will catch fire. No, this is this is oven safe. Grease proof and bacon paper. This is fine. 
People are panicking. Like, the oven might explode, Daniel. You power your home with gas. Gas is flammable. Holy shit, it's gonna be an inferno. Like, you guys don't trust me with anything. Okay, the flour on the baking paper, a bit of a mistake, all right? I'll give you a credit for that one. But like, I, I've survived 27 years on this planet, right? I only almost ate a flour that one time. I think we're fine. Okay. Thin crust. Here we go. Okay, the problem is going to be transferring this. The problem... Let me get a second spatula. Hang on. How the fuck do I transfer this? I need to, like, airlift it. Pick it up, it's gonna fall apart. Oh. oh! Okay, it's mostly intact. It's mostly intact. Hang on, let me just uh, unfold it a bit. We're okay. We're okay. It's pizza base one. Done. Okay. I just gotta do that again. And I need to smooth. Okay, okay so that's just when we get there, right? I just need to do this next bit. Okay. All right, rolling. It's one hour per step. Listen. It's 25 minutes preparation time, right? But what they don't show you on cooking programs is like every single step, and that's why it looks like it just takes five minutes. Here I am slaving away at my kitchen top to try and get it right. I don't have like a magical oven where it's like, here's one I made earlier. No, I'm fucking making it right now. So you gotta be patient, little shits, right? Reminder, the extra ingredient doing it this way is love. I can't wait to eat it. I wouldn't think that far ahead. I wouldn't think that far ahead. <laughs> okay. Let me roll this out. Look at that. Look at all that dough. It's gonna be such a nice, thin crust. It's gonna be healthy. You know every ingredient that went into it, you know? Cause like sometimes when you order fast food, like they just put salt all over it and it's gonna like, like kill your taste buds. Not with our pizza. Not with our pizza. We put like good stuff in it. Okay, that's roughly a hexagon, so that should be good. Oh shit, it's sticking. This is gonna be messy. You gotta be brave sometimes when you make pizza, right? Oh, good lord. No. <laughs> no. I can fix it. I can fix it.
I'm just gonna iron it out a bit. It's not looking too good, gang. That's yours. That's yours. That one's mine. Kelly's gonna eat this one, so don't worry. I'm gonna try to take it off the paper. Okay, we could just we could just need it again. If I turn that bit of paper upside down, it should be okay. More flour, more flour. There we go. Oh, that was the problem. That was the problem. There we go. Okay. It's not going to spread out any more than that, unfortunately. So we're just going to go with it. Uh, this one... This one's just going to be a little pizza. This is going to be a little pizza. Okay? Hang on, I can press it out a bit here. Okay, it's not so bad. It's not so bad. It's half the size of the other one, but it's not so bad. I think that'll be okay. God, there's dough everywhere. Pizza's so fucking messy. <laughs> Just think about the savings, you know? Because, like, if we ordered Domino's, we would have got, like, two large cooked pizzas with like a drink of choice, garlic bread and potato wedges, all for about 22 euro. They do a special on Tuesdays. Buying all of these ingredients and when you factor in the energy costs, probably only cost roughly 40 euro. Okay? Uh, like, so just think of like the quality in comparison that we've got here. And we can make even more pizzas. We can make, I, like, look how much fucking flour they give you. I can make so many more pizzas. I can make so many more. So it's not, it doesn't just stop after you put down the phone. You can have pizza every day. Don't do that, you'll get sick. But you can. Okay. The dough is prepared. Uh, the oven isn't hot enough. Let me warm that up. <laughs> let me just, let me just adjust that. That's fine. Okay, the oven's warming up. I just eat it raw. No, you can't eat it raw. It'll, it'll fucking kill you. Don't do it. Is that gonna kill me anyway? Uh, we need to put the sauce over the base of the back of the spoon and scatter cheese and tomatoes. We don't have tomatoes, but we're gonna put other toppings on. Okay, so this is where we get to the fun stuff. This is where the real fun begins, okay? Hang on, oh, you guys are not ready. Okay, um, I'm not ready either. I need to clean this off, hang on. Give me one sec, there's so much damn flour. There we go. Hang on, I'm still here, you can see. You can see my hand, I'm still here. Don't freak out, please. <laughs> Remain calm. There we go. Okay, I'm still here, I'm still here. Okay, we're getting to the fun stuff. This is where the fun begins. All right. Oh, I don't have enough room. Uh, let me put that back there. Okay, so I need to load up. One second, let me get another spoon. 
I'm just gonna use this spoon real quick to get the other spoon out of there. There we go. Okay. Uh, and now, we can put the sauce on. Is that a fire emote? Oh no, that's, okay, no, that's, that's blasphemy. Okay, sorry. I was concerned there. I think we're okay. That's okay. Alright. Okay, it's tomato sauce time. So. Uh, smooth sauce over the bases with the back of the spoon. Watch this, watch this. I'm gonna put extra sauce on each. Dollop some of that on. Good shit here, good shit. tomato all over. You want to try and get it as close to the edge as you can. Pay attention here. You don't want to get this bit wrong. Okay. If you're struggling to keep up, simply pause the live stream and you can watch it back at your own pace later so you can make your own pizza, okay? Here we go. That's one. Now here's two. Spread it around. Should have put more sauce on this one, but that's okay. That's okay. Sometimes you just don't like as much tomato. It's fine. Okay. Now sometimes if you run a bit low, just get the tomato passata and just add a little bit more on. Just a little bit more on. There we go. Bit of extra sauce. That's okay, because when we mix all that, it's gonna just absorb the spices that we put in. Chiefly the salt, the pepper, and the salt. Okay. Look at that. Look at that. That's sauce on dough. That's sauce on dough. It's looking wonderful. Okay. Uh, next, we need to scatter the cheese. Scatter the cheese. What cheese have I got? 125 grams of mozzarella. Sliced. Let me go to my fridge. So much wonderful things to put on the pizza here. Um. No, that's white cheddar. Okay, look at this. Look at this. It, it, it feels kind of slimy for some reason. I don't know why. But we're gonna slice this up in just a moment. Oh! I didn't. I didn't expect that much liquid in the bag. Okay, we got our mozzarella out. Hang on. I didn't expect that much liquid. <laughs> Let me just, um, hang on. 
There's cheese all over the floor. There's cheese everywhere. <laughs> Um... I got an idea. Okay, put it in there. Uh, I'm just gonna rinse down the board again. Oh, I gotta be careful. Nice, yeah, nice uh, clean tea towel here just to wipe this off. There we go. Look at that. Okay, now we're ready to slice some mozzarella. What? Oh, Your battery's low. Again. My battery's low. Oh no! Can you see the? Uh, Okay, I can change the battery. I'm, I'm worried it's gonna die. I'm still here for now. Uh... Okay. Uh, two minute interval. The stream will still be online. Okay, it's gonna, it's gonna go, it's gonna go completely dark for a moment. I have to turn off the camera and change the battery. But... After that, um, join me. We're finally gonna top the pizza, okay? Give me, give me two minutes here. Two minutes. Okay, let me turn off the camera now. Oh, are we live? I think we're back. I think we're back. Can you hear us? Okay. Ow! <laughs> I just got my finger caught in the camera. Okay. Okay. Hello? Hello, audio check. Can you hear me okay? Yeah, that's fine, that's fine. Uh, all, all the camera UI stuff will disappear in a moment. Hang on, let me just take a picture. Hang on. <laughs> there we go. Uh, that'll even itself out in a moment. Okay, it seems to be following me for some reason. It's a bit menacing. It should, it should just get rid of most of the UI components. I think I have to stand perfectly still.
and um, hopefully, hopefully it will fade. If I move, it's gonna just stay here. Please fucking turn off. Please fucking turn off. I don't think it's gonna do- It's not doing it. I don't know why- Oh, thank god. Okay. Alright, alright. Oh. Uh, we're lopsided again. It's just- it, it, It's fine. It's fine. It should be okay. Let me roll up my sleeves. Okay, we're almost there. We're almost at the fun stuff. Now I have to dice the mozzarella. Got another knife. How much do I need to cut this? It's just sliced. It's just sliced. Let me, let me slice our mozzarella. I think this will spread out a bit as we go. <sighs> let me see how our chat's doing. Yeah, like, let's, let's get some, we can get some questions in. This is gonna take a moment to prepare. How y'all doing? Are you enjoying the pizza? One person said yes, that's a win for me. You wanna be careful there. Yeah, okay, uh, let me just cut that one in two. Okay, so that should be enough mozzarella for both pizzas. So let me just start like... Slapping this on. Let me just put some more of that there. Bit more of that. Uh, and that one, two, three, four, and then the little bit, and then one, two, three, four, and the little bit. So they've all got the same amount of cheese. There we go. Okay. If Jesus can feed over 5,000 people, then Dad can too. <laughs> it's just like the loaves and the fishes, you know, the parable. Except it's like the two pizzas. We're gonna spread it around, like, I'll hand you all the slice. And it's like, my god, the pizza just doesn't run out. Everyone was fed. I said, like, oh my god, like, he has a drink as well. It's a Diet Coke. We're gonna make it go far. You can make a new religion out of this. Worship thy father. Okay, I don't like that. I don't like how that sounds. Uh, oh, <laughs> religion's been abandoned. Religion's been abandoned. No, you, you made it weird. You made it weird. You made it. You made it too weird. Oh, sorry, I missed a bit of mozzarella. Hang on, let me just slap that on there. Okay, it's time for the fun stuff, guys. Sorry, wait, I'm a bit. It's time for the fun stuff, guys. Pizza toppings. We finally made it. We finally made it. Now I've... I've broken the bank here, all right. So I have, at the moment, so in case we want it, the finest frozen chicken. Now this was frozen before. I know the expiry date says the 16th of August. This was in my freezer though, and it's still good. It's been frozen for a while. We have some lovely chicken. We can fry that up first, so we can pop it on. But I have more options. I have more options. I have even more cheese. I can dice you what's left of my mushrooms or yellow pepper. Let's get all our options out. Let's get all our options out. I wanted to make sure we got every possible pizza topping. 
I have a giant bag of spinach. In case pop buys here. We have a jar of pesto. Um, I have a single red onion. I have another bag of mozzarella, just in case. Uh, no, we have enough of that one. We have enough of that one. Never mind. I have a third bag of mozzarella. This one's already shredded, so that's easier for me to use. And I also have in the freezer. Get a load of this. Get a load of this. Get a load of this. You see this place here? My freezer. I have ice. No, that's not right. I have cauliflower and broccoli. I have some more cauliflower. I have some green beans. Oh, and I forgot one. Hang on. Uh, oh, I forgot a very important one. Hang. On. How could I be so careless? Because you know, it's not. It's uh, it's a pizza topping that you know I'm not the biggest fan of. I'm not the biggest fan of. You know, and I, I may have voiced some concern about it, but you know, I want to give you the options just because, in fairness, of course I have pepperoni. Of course I have pepperoni. I can't believe I forgot that. I can't. I can't believe I forgot that. Okay, so pizza number one. What would you like on it? What would you like? More salt. <laughs> okay, so this one. <laughs> Fucking hell, guys. This is Chat's Pizza. <laughs> More salt. <laughs> you can, there's so many options here. There's so many options. Is that me as a topping? I don't like that. I don't like that either. Don't be weird, Chat. <laughs> they want more cheese. They want, well, you're gonna have fucking more cheese. Okay. Alright, here we go. Here we go. Right, let me... Where the fuck did my scissors get there? Right. They want an ice pizza. It'll just get soggy. The ice wasn't an option. <laughs> Look at this, look. I, look, in the restaurant, I, I, like whenever you go to the Domino's and that, it's like, no, oh, they were stingy with the toppings. They only gave me like two slices of, like pieces of pepperoni on my pizza slice. This is why dad treats you well. Like, holy shit, there's so much on it. There's so much on it. Okay. What? <laughs> All good, okay. Cheese there. What else do you want? What else do you want? I'd rather not do the chicken, I'll be honest, because I have to fry it at this point. And like, the, the, the entire kitchen's a mess, so I... The, the chicken's... I'm just gonna veto. I'm just gonna veto the chicken. Um, you can't have chicken. No, oh, sorry. You can't, you know, it, it, the kitchen, the countertop is a complete fucking disaster at this point. Like, I'm just, I'm just not doing it. I'm not doing it. Pepperoni? Look how much pepperoni we have. Look how much we have. And it's like, normally when you get the pepperoni as well, normally when you get the pepperoni, it's like, no, oh, like they only put like one slice on this pizza. We're gonna take a fucking stack. 
and just start layering it. I physically can't fit more on that. I physically can't put more on that. So we can we can spread some of the pepperoni out here. We can spread it out here too. It's literally covered. This is the most fun part. This is why you make it yourself. Look, there's so much meat on that now. So much meat. Okay, what else do you want? What else do you want? Are you making the pizza like where, are we, where are we going next? Are you making it the same? Where are we going next? Hang on. Spinach? I saw some spinach. Good. You guys have taste. You guys have taste. Little bit of spinach. Little bit of spinach. Look at all that. It's gonna be so nice. I'll put spinach on one, because spinach isn't for everyone. I'll put spinach on that one, okay? Put spinach on that one. The Jack Daniels and salt. I don't know if Dad should really be doing this, right? So. But he's gonna pour some on the side for you. There you go. I don't. Don't tell Mom. Don't tell mom for the love of God. Okay. There's some Jack Daniels on the side for you for when you're done. Don't tell mom, please. Bad we're underage. Look, no one cares. We could just say we're in France. No one cares. You're 14 and you haven't wine, right? Okay, get some mushroom, get some mushroom. Let's get some mushroom, give these a little wash first. Give them a little wash. Hang on. Please don't drop them in the bowl, I'll never be able to recover them. Give them a little wash. Get them nice and fresh for you. Nice and fresh. Put the salt in the jack. What's wrong with you people? <laughs> oh bloody tell mom! That you're ruining a perfectly good drink. Okay, let's get some nice mushroom slices. Probably move the Jack Daniels. <laughs> Let me just <laughs> Let me just put that away for now. Let me put that away. Okay. Now I think we're gonna pop the mushroom on this one too, okay? I think we're gonna pop the mushroom on this one. So mushroom spinach. There's a lot of pepperoni here, but like this is also kind of like a veggie option. Load that up with some some nice mushroom there. We'll put it on that half of the pizza as well. Because, you know, half a chat might not want mushroom on their half of the pizza. So we can separate it. We can do that too. Take that, Domino's. Put even more cheese on. Can we have ice in the Jack Daniels? <laughs> Okay, give me a minute, hang 
But we're supposed to be making pizza. It's, it, it's gonna be more like slushy ice. Oh no. Yeah. We're making pizza. There you go, chat. There you go, you got ice. Okay. We got ice. We got ice. What else what else do we need? What else do we need? I gotta crouch down. The camera's being weird again. I don't know why. Maybe I can tilt it back. Hang on. Mm. Bit better. I don't have to crouch so much. I just feel like a giant. How are we doing on time as well? You want an egg? Egg pizza? I don't, I don't know about that chat. Yeah, I, I don't, I don't, I don't know about that. I don't, I really don't. I think that's kind of weird. I think that's kind of weird. Okay. Alright. I do have a surprise for you. Okay. Now, you have all these fanciful toppings here. Oh, I'm going to offer you what's in the box. Now, I'm not going to tell you what's in the box, but the condition is, if you accept the contents of the box, that is your final topping for the pizzas. Uh, if the uh, if the if it's possible, could the moderators please poll it? This is an important moment for the stream. It's important to get right. Can we please have a poll for what's in the box? Yes or no? I have no way of knowing if the poll is right. There, there it is. What does it say? Do you want the mystery box? Okay, here we go. Eleven percent of you just like no tanks. That's fine. <laughs> I've had enough now. I don't. I don't want what's in the box. Okay. I think it's pretty clear. I think it's okay. It's pretty clear. It's pretty clear. Thank you, democracy. Thank you. Okay. Let me clean up some of this shit. Let me just clean up some of it. Gotta make room. Okay, we're opening the- we're gonna open the mystery box. Give me one sec. I don't know where to put these mushrooms. I got- I, I just gotta clean up a little. I gotta clean up a little. Just need to make some space. Uh. Okay, we're gonna get in real close for this too. Are you ready, chat? Cause this is a big moment. It's a big moment incoming. Hello. Hello. I really gotta crouch down. Let me just uh, stack the mushrooms precariously on top of the pesto. 
it's never gonna fucking work. Okay. Are you guys ready? You didn't think I'd do it. You didn't think I'd do it. We're gonna put pineapple on pizza. I have no fucking idea how I'm supposed to prepare this. How the fuck do you start? What do I do with this? Move the Jack Daniels. Need it. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna have to, uh, back up with the camera. Oh god, the setup is so scuffed. <laughs> there we go. I, I, I don't know how to prepare this, I'm gonna be honest with you. Um... I, mean, I I assume this is incorrect. If I cut the ends off, maybe that's a good place to start. Fuck, that's tough. Okay. Okay. I'm getting somewhere. Now cut the sides. I'll be honest, I feel like I'm losing a lot of the pineapple. I need his house. Okay. I have a, I have like a hexagon. I, I think there's still a core, isn't there? How do I get the core out? The core is bad. Okay, how, how do I, how do I do this? Also, my nose is incredibly itchy, so I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna scra- uh. Don't know why. It got really itchy there all of a sudden. I'm just gonna wash my hands. I'm not picking my nose. It just got itchy. It just got itchy. It happens to the best of us. It happens to the best of us. You're not allergic, are you? I don't- I, I've had pineapple on stuff before. <laughs> this would be a real, like, cruel twist of fate if after all this time I finally try it, it's like, Oh no, it's gonna kill him. Okay, how do I, like, get the core out? I can see the core here. Do I just, like, cut around this? Yeah, okay. okay. So that's all- that's all juicy pineapple there. Right. More juicy pineapple. Getting as much of that as I can, okay. So pineapple, 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 pineapple. That's a lot of skin. Now what? 
Put only the core on it. No, that's not that's not correct. Is there anything else I can salvage from this? No. Just gonna. Are you guys sure? It seems pretty okay there, but I. I, I all right, I'll, I'll trust you. I'll trust you. There's a lot of residue with a pineapple. <laughs> we only got all like all this out of that. That's not a lot. Okay, so I need to thinly slice it. Do I? I'm gonna use start with this big block. How's that for a thin slice? Look at that. I think we should be able to get enough out of this central block. There we go. So, you know, I might... I might not, like, I personally like this, right? As a topping. And I may think that everyone who enjoys pineapple on top of pizza, you know, should probably spend some time in hell after they leave this eternal plane. But, I'll still make it for you here. Because it'll kill you faster. But don't say I'm not considerate. Don't say I'm not considerate, because I'm a very considerate man. Don't say otherwise. It doesn't look as good as the rest. I want only the finest ingredients for my pizza. Okay. So, you get to pick one of the pizzas to put the pineapple on. Do you want the pineapple going on the pepperoni cheese or like the pepperoni veg? Uh, if the mods could create another poll, please. If the mods could get another poll, because I'm gonna eat one of these pizzas after this stream, and I'm not fucking touching the whole pineapple on. You kidding me? Um, so if, if the mods could have another poll, please. It's a very important decision. Absolutely crucial. What pizza do you want to ruin? <laughs> this is how I select my mods. <laughs> They, they're like-minded. Oh, even in the interview process is the question we ask. It seems to be that the one on the left is winning. Okay, so the cheesy pineapple supreme. You people make me sick. Okay, I'll make the pizza then. Pop some of these on. Just gonna kind of sit on top of the pepperoni. God, I wish we had more surface area. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna load this as much as possible. By the way, you guys want pineapple on pizza? Like you're getting fucking pineapple. I'm gonna layer this. There you go. It's terrible. It's terrible. Okay. Let me see what the recipe calls for now. Because I think we're at the end is in sight. Bake for 8 to 10 minutes until crisp. Serve with a little more olive oil and basil leaves if using. We're not. Repeat step for the remaining pizza. Can I just bake these at the same time? I assume that's going to be okay. Yeah. Yeah, that'll be fine. I was supposed to drizzle it with olive oil at some point, too. 
I'll be honest, I think we have enough olive oil. <laughs> I think we have enough. We'll die. <laughs> okay, just, just a touch. Just a touch. Just... Just a touch. Just a touch. There we go. Okay. Important part. Important part in the process. You see that oven there? I gotta put them in there. Gotta put them in, and I not position my trays. Give me one second, because I could really hurt myself if I don't do this properly. Double oven gloves. Put that there, there for a mo. It's very hot. Oh, yeah. Wait, is that, that tray the wrong way around? Oh, bollocks it is. It's like an inferno. There we go. Okay, I, th I think we're good. Maybe if I pop this one up the top, that should be okay. No, no, that's too high. Pop it. Pop it there. Okay. Woo! Oh, I still have to put the pizza in. Hang on. Okay, is pizza number one? Is pizza number two? Why is everyone? Reheat the oven, it... It's already... Yeah, it'll be fine, it'll heat up. We can just cook it a little longer. Everything in there is already cooked. Well, except the raw vegetables, but like, it'll cook again. It'll cook again. It'll cook again! It's fine, it'll warm back up. I, I'll, I'll be honest, I think we need... Why did it make a noise? It'll be fine, right? Okay. Let's set up a nice cozy corner here. Cheers, chat. Can you see me okay? No, you can't even see me. Hang on. There we go. Okay, welcome to Pizza Watch. Oh, cheers. Did you preheat it? It's heating back up again. It'll be heated. It's cooking. Set a timer. God, that's strong straight. <laughs> It'll be fine. This is part of the process we're cooking with Dad. And sometimes Dad needs to sit down for a moment, right? It's 
sit further away, it's fine. If you see a flicker, it's just because a bit of the paper is blown in the oven fan. But it's honestly fine, right? It's not on fire. <laughs> it's fine. Let me just set like, a quick timer, okay? Ten minutes until dinner's ready. Get excited, gang. It's just the pan. It's just the pan. It pops sometimes, you know? Just all the heat. It's toasty. Kelly? Yeah? The oven's not gonna explode, is it? I mean, after what you just said, maybe. So that's not yes, then? It's a possibility. Yeah, we should be fine. We should be fine. Cheers! Should be alright. It's not on fire. Yeah, so some quality time with myself. I look very small, I realize, from this perspective. Uh, I could be cleaning up as well, but I'm not gonna. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna take a moment. How are all of you doing in chat? Get some quality time in. At any questions you've always wanted to ask me, now's the time for it. How are y'all doing? Scared. Anxious. When are you playing Fortnite? I have to wait till I'm 36 years old. I, I, I promise. Not on fire. I promise chat. Do you fear Dash 10? Hey look, the oven's heated, preheated. See, the light went off. Um, no, no, not particularly. Not particularly. I used to be very scared. I used to be. But I'm doing okay these days. If pineapple and pizza kill your dad? I don't think so. Like, he's still alive. I'd be surprised if that's what did him in. Will you play Dark Souls 2? I actually want to play more Dark Souls games. I, I fucking love the Soul series. Um, I feel like we already got like, Dark Souls 1 last year, and then Bloodborne and Elden Ring. So I'm just kind of taking some downtime, basically. But I do, I do want to play them. There's a lot of games that I, I kind of just want to do a series on, like, there's even a few that we streamed recently that like, I'm debating playing more of. I haven't just, I just haven't decided, like, I like Darkest Dungeon a lot. Um, I know it's kind of slow and grindy, but I really enjoy that game. Uh, it's not on fire. I, I really liked um, Civ as well that we just played. That was really good fun. Call of the Lamb. Um, thank you. Any pets or plans to get one? Uh, I'm, I, I'd really want to get a cat. Uh, I, I miss having a cat. I miss poor old George, may he rest in peace. Um, I think like it, it kind of helps my mental well-being just like kind of having a cat or having an animal like that, you know, because they're just such a, like, a bundle of joy and love uh, and, you know, comfort. Um, uh, my apartment doesn't, sadly, doesn't allow cats, so I, I kind of have to wait a while, but like, that's like once I move out, basically, because, um, you know, I want to house someday um that's like top of the list i get a cat a dark one uh i also have the novel idea in my head um of not just a cat but also like a rabbit and like a duck or something and they're all just the best of friends and they have adventures like i don't know something about that's just really cute to me uh, i don't think i'm really a dog person because there's too much maintenance um but yeah, I, 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 I love the idea of something like that, honestly. It's like a little Animal Crossing gang. Currently, for pets, uh, I have uh, Mareep, uh, you know, Crumpet, and um, there's a Roomba in the apartment, so that's like half of the functionality of a cat right there. You know, they kind of just aimlessly wander and bump into stuff. Um... Where's the apron from? You'd have to ask Josie. You'd have to ask Josie. I'm sorry, Josie, as well. I keep, I don't know why I keep getting it mixed up. I think my mum bought me an apron as well, and that's why I keep getting the two confused. 
Because my mum saw one of the bacon streams and I, even I told her that it's like, I have to borrow one of yours. So I think that's why in my head it's so muddled. Uh, sure, this probably doesn't help. What's the Roomba called? Roomby. Roomby. It's a very original name. Um, it's after the naming scheme of when I was a kid, where, not on fire, uh, I had a Ted called White Ted, and a Yellow Ted called Yellow Ted. You know, it, it, it's quite complicated, but uh, I'm a simple man. <laughs> We play the new Kirby. The new Kirby's the old Kirby, isn't it? It's like the one on Wii, but right remastered. I have another Kirby game on my shelf that I've just never got around to playing. I really did like the first Kirby. I kind of just hope that they do more 3D ones. I like platformers, but it's like, I played a lot of 2D ones, and it's like, ever since even playing Hollow Knight, like, that in my opinion is just the best 2D platformer I think I've ever played. Like, I, I don't think it comes close. I think Hollow Knight is just amazing. Um, well, Celeste, Celeste would be up there too. Celeste would be up there too. Um, but it's like, because they innovate so much, it feels like, compared to like some of the older platformers. So I don't know. I'm kind of on the fence. Not on fire. It's not burned, is it? No, I don't think so. I don't think so. We're good. Uh, what else have we got? Have you played Epic Yarn? It's cute. I got, I tried Epic Yarn on Wii. I got so bored. <laughs> Uh, I think it's just because the game doesn't have any consequence, you know, it's a nice, fun, casual time, but you have to be in the mood for that. I, I, I like a little bit of a stake, if that makes sense. You, know, you can probably tell from like me loving the Dark Souls games, even doing like Pokemon and those and shit. I like some stakes. Awful taste. You're the guys who requested pineapple on the bloody pizza, right? You don't get to talk to me about taste. Look at the pizza, it's flashing. No, it's just a bit of paper that's like near the light at the back. That's all that's going on. We'll check on them soon. We'll check on them soon, okay? I gotta give them 10 minutes. Let's see. God, chat's moving quick. Did you hear that the Pokemon company hates Nuzlocke and sees it as bad as ROM hacks? Um, I saw that tweet, so... It, it's like half true, I think. Like, um, oh, what was it? Because, like, cause, like, Sarah, like uh, Joe, Joe Merrick from Cerebi was talking about it. Um, yeah, because it, it, it sounds ridiculous, like, in isolation. Basically, the Pokemon company thinks if you do it like a Nuzlocke, you might as well be hacking the game. Which is just, like, blatantly untrue, because it's just, like, a play style. It's like, if I play the Pokemon game with, like, only Dragon-type Pokemon, I'm, I'm not hacking. That's just a preference. There's some kind of misunderstanding there, and I'd like to think that something is lost in translation there, too. Because it just sounds bloody ridiculous and stupid. I, I think Cerebi was talking about it, or like Joe from there. The guy who runs Cerebi. I can't remember exactly what it is. You have great meme quality. What does that mean? I don't understand. I'm not very cultured on the internet. Have you tried Okami or Hades? I have Hades, uh, uh, I have both those. I picked up Okami once and it just didn't grip me. I, I still have it. Um, Hades I've never played, but I really want to give it a go at some point. How long have you been cooking now? Um, what time did we start this stream? Did I start the timer? No, I did, I did. It's another minute and a half. Another minute and a half. We're almost there. Pineapple one looks like it's raised quite a bit. I think it's because of the toe. Oh, that's gonna be a lot of fucking bread. We're gonna have to try the pizza in a moment. Do you have any book recommendations? I've been rereading a great one uh, called What If. It's by the guy who does the XKCD comics, I believe is the initials of it. Um, it's, re it's really fun read. It's basically... Um, scientific answers to absurd hypothetical questions. So it's like, what if we just all jumped on the earth at once? Or it's like, what if like a glass of water was instantly replaced by nothing? And it's like the actual scientific explanation of what would happen if like suddenly there was a vacuum. Um, it, 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 it's a good one. 
Vsauce the book. I mean, I would compare it, honestly. If you like Vsauce, it's probably a good comparison. The comics in it are very cute as well. Uh, it kind of just breaks it up, you know, it's, it's refreshing. I, I used to read a lot of, like, the horrible history books when I was a kid. And, you know, they, they used to be kind of interspersed with, like, little doodles and comics as well. As well. But, you know, it's fun. It gets you reading. It's always a good thing. Would you ever try Apollo Justice? No, I'm good. I'm good. I've had my fill of Phoenix Wright. Uh, I'm happy with what I've played. Okay, the timer is up. The timer is up. Alright. Quickly, and let's put... Let's put the whiskey down. Alright. Big moment here. Let me get my oven gloves. Cause safety first. I have to clear I have to clear all this pine up. Okay, let me let me let me check it first. Let me get this. Safety. I have a pine here, see? Get the heat. Okay. Do you think that's done? I'd say so. I'd say so. Fuck me, it's warm. My fan likes to blow the heat right in your face. Let me see. A little longer. Alright. Let me check the other one. What about that one? I think that one's good. I can put him in for like two minutes more just to get him a bit more crispy. We'll do it, we'll do another few minutes, okay? Let me set another timer. Let me set another timer, hang on. They say the bottom's done. The bottom's done, okay, I'm gonna give it three more minutes. Three more minutes. Gonna make sure the pizza's nice and crispy, okay? Can you guys even see me? Hang on. There we go. Paper's fine. Yeah, let me get let me get the chat up again. The bottom looks fine, top looks like the cheese has even melted. That's the pineapple on top. That's the pineapple on top. I can take out the bottom one. You want me to take out the bottom one? It does smell good. We have a witness. So that means it's real. Okay, I'll take out the bottom one. Hang on. Hang on. Safety first. We could really hurt ourselves here. That's one pizza out. That pizza, that actually looks really good. Oh my god, okay. Let me show you what's going on here, and then we'll just let that one uh, stew a little bit longer. Let me get the oven mitts on so I can hold this up to the camera. Look at that! That actually looks really good. And it's roughly a round shape. It came out pretty good. I think that one's pretty good. I'm excited to eat that one. I'm not for the other one. Um, there's pineapple on it, but... One out of two ain't bad. One out of two ain't bad. Uh... I'm trying to get chat up on my phone again. Hang on. It's died on me. It's died on me. Okay, I can see you again, I can see you. Why is it so wet and shiny? That's probably just the lighting. Like, it actually, it actually looks pretty good. It looks pretty good. Take a photo of the pizza. I'll take a, I'll take a picture of both the pizzas in just a moment. I'll take a picture of both of them. Is the crust crispy? 
I would say so. I would say so. Are you still going to EGX this weekend? Yeah, I'll be at EGX next week. Uh, I'll be in the we'll, I'll be in the UK for a spell, and we're all going to be hanging out. It's going to be good fun. Okay, timer's up. Timer's up. Hang on. Yeah. Okay. Robin Cam. Safety first. Jesus Christ. Oh no! All the pineapple fell off! Hang on. Oh no! No, no, no! I don't think. <laughs> Turn off the oven. Um. Oh, this is a disaster. Hang on. <laughs> I think we stacked it too high. <laughs> Do you see where the pizza is? And then there's all the pineapple. <laughs> I eat this pizza now though, because all the pineapple fell off. Oh, great! <laughs> well, happy days! I couldn't have gotten better! <laughs> it worked out! Okay. And now, we have to get ready. To serve it. Presentation's important here. Give me uh, just two minutes here. Give me one minute. Coming back. Hang on. Take just a moment. There. Just a moment. I'm not dead. It's just been greatly exaggerated. Look, I'm alive, I'm alive. Let me get some of this. Here we go. Okay. Now, give me... <laughs> okay, the problem is getting this on the plate. Problem is getting this on the plate. Um, give me one more minute. I gotta. Ow! Oh, it's still pineapple. Oh, <laughs> I can't pick it up like that. Oh, I was just trying to clear space. Ow! Right, let me just. Uh... I don't think I don't think anyone wants this. Into the bin it goes. Okay, I just scratched my finger off the pineapple. Yeah, I need to get these off the paper. One second more. This is going to be dicey. I, I just realized, right? I don't think this happened here. 
Is it just me, or does it look like the top of my oven glove at some point caught fire? What did you do? I don't think this happened just there. No, that didn't happen just there, but... I don't remember when that happened. <laughs> I was just looking at it, I was like, hang on a minute. <laughs> That's a bit weird, ain't it? I don't know what's going on there. <laughs> oh, that looks so good. Okay, this one, this one actually turned out really damn well. Uh, this one does not, but this isn't my pizza, so it's okay. It's okay. Uh, this one, so you remember that problem we had with the, oh, Jesus. Ah, it's dripping! It's dripping! Okay, so... <laughs> if you ignore the fact that all of the toppings fell off this, let me just... If you ignore the fact that all of the toppings fell down here, it's kind of okay. It's kind of okay. <laughs> No, that's not my pizza. Let me, let me, let me set these over here. Let's set these over here. Oh, we're almost done. We're almost done. Presentation's everything. Let me get my patented pizza roller. Gonna get a plate as well. Okay. We're almost set, we're almost set. Just one or two more things. I have a little scene to show you guys. Hang on one sec. Hang on one sec. This is gonna be... Hang on. Okay, hang on one sec. This is gonna be messy. I need to wait for the UI to go away on the camera again. Give me, give me two minutes. Hang on. Okay, you guys almost reset. We're almost ready. Just a minute or two more. Almost there. I'm not dead. I'm not dead. Give me just one minute. Okay. Don't don't break this. Look at that. The gang's all here for a pizza party. Just, uh, you are he's gonna be back. Hello. Okay. It's here on up here. We're just gonna move the buff bear. His name is Pablo. Have him just sit there. There we go. Would anyone like a slice of pizza? Let's cut this open. Uh, 
I apologize for the sound of this on the plate. It's fine, they're durable. Look at this, chat. Look at this. Pizza is here. We did it. Let's try some. Moment of truth. Oh, fuck, it's hot. Really hard to hold. <laughs> I'm just waiting for this bit to give way. Hang on. Hang on. Come on. There we go. Oh. <laughs> I got. Oh. No, no. Oh, I can taste the olive oil. <laughs> the strongest flavor is the fucking olive oil. Bon appetit! Uh, you know, uh, hang on, wait, let me get my, uh, hang on. I'm gonna need this. I'm gonna need this whiskey. My pizza's real tasty. Oh. I'm gonna go big rock. <laughs> oh, there we go. There we go. Hello, hello. Hello. Um Thank you so much everyone for coming by the stream today. I hope you all enjoyed it. We have pizza for chat. Try our pizza too? Fuck off. <laughs> I'll try it later. I'll try it later. Um, but yeah, I, I, I really do hope everyone enjoyed this. Um, as promised, uh, like the deck for the Pokemon, like kind of Twitch Plays Pokemon stream is repaid. We finally got chat takeout as well. I, I hope everyone enjoyed this. I want to say a massive thank you to just everyone who's been kind of giving subs and bits um, just during this stream. I've had like no like kind of like kind of real response or like kind of like feedback for myself just while I've been streaming. So it's been really difficult for me to catch that. Um, so again, just 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 thank you there. I I I, I can see the chat. In case you wonder why I'm looking over here, it's where my laptop is. Looking at my phone as well because I've got the chat here as well. I feel people enjoyed it. Uh, I also like to give a special thank you just to Kelly, who's like kind of hiding in the background there because she's just been helping me get shit ready. Uh, she's just visiting from the States at the moment. Um, and you know, I, 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 she'll let you know how the pineapple pizza tastes, so you really gotta thank her. I'll leave a review. Uh, you're not gonna, no, don't leave a review, please. I don't need that on my TripAdvisor page. <laughs> um, thank you as ever to the mods as well for just kind of helping with the polls and that, and just keeping an eye on things. Uh, I do hope people have enjoyed the stream. Uh, the reason I'm saying all of this is because because of the janky setup we have for this, um, I literally just have to walk over there now and the stream is going to very abruptly end. Uh, I have no credits for subs, I don't have anything set up on this computer because of the weird janky setup we have to do for it, so like, it's literally going to end in like 30 seconds uh, once I walk off camera here, which is why I'm just kind of saying this. So like, again, like th thank you to everyone who subbed, thank you to everyone who gave bits. Thank you to the mods as ever for being on hand, and I do hope everyone enjoyed this mess of a stream. Uh, I'm gonna have to clean up my kitchen for probably the next three hours after this. Um, I believe we invited Josie around for pizza as well. Um, I'll be honest, if she was watching this stream, I don't know if she wants to come. But I've got whiskey! Counter offer! Um... <laughs> yeah, so uh, uh, we're just gonna have to wrap it up there. 
Uh, so I'm gonna hit the go offline button. Thank you so much for coming, folks. If you want more to watch from me, there are Civ highlights up on YouTube. Uh, I will be back with one more stream before I go to EGX next week on Tuesday as well. Uh, we have a space cleanup game. Uh, they've been kindly sponsored to play, so we're gonna check it out. Um, and then next week as well then, there's some secret stuff I can't talk about, but we're gonna be at EGX. We're gonna be in the UK and it's gonna be fun. And um, we're doing a group meet and greet with like the entire like kind of gang that we play like board games and shit with on the channel. Kelly will be there, like Spiff will be there, Q will be there. Uh, Ash will be there. Merrick will be there too. It'll be a good time. Uh, so yeah. Should be fun. Right. I'll fuck off now. See ya!